Hello everyone, welcome to another episode from me. This is Craft of Genius with my One Game at a Time series and we're playing some online seasons on FIFA 13 Ultimate Team. This is the team I'm playing against. As you can see, they've got some pretty beastly players in the form of David Villa, Xabi Alonso and, and a whole load of other players too. So I was expecting a hard game from this and I sure got it was. It was a really hard opponent just solely because of his team. But I get the lucky goal here. And, uh, not lucky, uh, the first goal in the game, and uh, it's with the foe. And I thought, great, I really should have uh, sweated the goal there, but um, it's a great start to the game, and I was really pumped, excited to beat this really tough team. And uh, had chance after chance with my Premier League players, but his goalie was really good, and uh, done some double saves there to make a great save overall. And uh, he gets a lucky goal here, smashes it through, and gets a really good goal, but. Um, Really, my, should have, my defenders should be dealing with that. Um, this game was a very end-to-end -end game. And uh, once I had a chance, he had a chance. His goalie made some decent saves um, in the 32nd minute of this game. And uh, it's basically shot after shot. And uh, it was resilient uh, action all the way. But he gets a really good goal here. Probably the best of the game. And I had to just stand there and applaud that he did get a great goal here. But, as with every game, I get so into it and I really wanted to beat him now. After his goal, then my goal, and it was just alternate between the two of us. So, here we go. This is uh, me uh, trying to break down his defence and trying to beat him for once and for all. And just coming up to half-time. His goalie, uh, I believe, was called Sirigu, and that's the goalie I've actually got and who I don't play. So that's maybe why he played so well. He wanted to prove himself. But luckily, Jabur scores a cracking goal, and my reaction was like this. Jabur! Yes! Come on! Yes! Come on! Game on, mate! Game on! But it was only a matter of time before uh, one of us scored, and f thank fucking shit, wank, that it was him. Ah! His attacks were really resilient and they came out wave after wave just like mine and luckily he got the next breakthrough as well um, and he somehow skims my two players and smashes it into the back of the net with Higuain which was a substitute player for an injured striker he had earlier in the game. Come on! Play better than that! For fuck's sake, come on! What is this? What is this? For fuck's sake. Calm down. Calm down. You can only pray and hope now. So 4-2 down, I was expecting the worst. I was expecting a loss. And he only does it again and scores a fifth goal, making it 5-2 now. It's not very good, is it? Being three goals up in the game, he was sweating it around at the back of the back of his half and then all of a sudden he comes out to Lampard who smashes it home to make it 5-3 so we're still two goals behind with 15 minutes to go in this game surely I can't do it can I hmm. well he's we still swinging it about and he didn't learn his lesson and uh, he somehow got a lucky break and uh, managed to have four attackers up with this attack and he scores again and it was really the nail in the coffin within this game really at least that's what I thought it comes up to his half after my kickoff, and I get a free kick. I thought it was a penalty, but it's just a free kick, I'm afraid. And Lampard's on the ball, hits it, and the goalie makes another good save. And uh, it looked like he was unbeatable, but luckily with Lampard's great um, set-piece statistics, he managed to get it to Kolarov, who smashed it in for... Five, six, four now. So I can't even keep count of these goals. And with just four minutes left, we really had to get an early goal to make our chances in the game worth playing for. And look at that, we get one with Jabur. This caused me to get all pumped up to score another. Holy mother of God! A team talk was also required for my players who had not performed this game. Okay guys, we have just made the biggest comeback of our careers. Saying this, we still need that one more goal to win a draw against one of the best ultimate teams we have ever faced. So I come to you today as a FIFA 13 ultimate team manager 
I want you to play your heart out. I want you to show me you deserve your spot in this squad. So Jabir, I want you up there, facing the defense, facing that goalie, right in the eye, slamming one home. Defoe, I want you pacing it down the wings, along with Adam Johnson on the side, crossing it in for Jabir to score. Lampard, you know what to do. Do your best. Do your duty. For God and the Queen, the King comes down. Let's do this! Don't move away from your screens now, because this is going to be a dramatic finish. He manages to fucking slide through my defenders and score another goal, though, finishing the game, leaving it 7-5. <laughs> So after one of the most goal festive games I've ever played, we do lose 7-5. I really should have come back, and unluckily I didn't. If you are into this series, be sure to check out my episode 1 that's already been posted yesterday. And also go and check out my 1000 subscriber special featuring Steve, and we're opening some FIFA 13 packs with real money. I'll see you all later, guys, for the next episode. Let's hope we win.